we can demonstrate the reaction of a non-metal with oxygen, this time with carbon. So we can add a bit of carbon to our deflagrating spoon and we can now place this over the Bunsen burner. Carbon is typically quite unreactive and we can leave it over the Bunsen burner to heat up. Um, and once it ignites, we can move it across to the gas jar, which contains oxygen. Again, due to the nature of carbon being quite unreactive here, it is unlikely to form any, any kind of lasting combustion reaction. But what we can show you, hopefully, is that the combustion of carbon is going to produce some carbon dioxide. And that carbon dioxide, we know since it's a non-metal oxide when combined with water, is going to produce an acidic solution that being carbonic acid. As we can see, placing it in oxygen does not necessarily make much of a difference. We can see that there is a slight orange glow, which we would normally see 